Yeah, Jordan Flynn, look at it, Jordan was brilliant, I thought he was the one Mayo player, especially throughout the game, I would say, that was really trying to bring the fight to London and show, show you know, obviously the experience he has, but, you know, he kicked two brilliant points in the first half, he was getting tackles in, he was winning turnovers, but he, he, he himself had, had plenty on his hands with the two London midfielders, because they were really, really good as well, but I thought Jordan put in a big, big shift in fairness to him, you know, Robbie in goal, you know, there was a couple of moments at the end there where it was last, ta- last ditch tackle and stuff, he was out around the middle at one stage trying to make tackles, but I think from a from an actual goalkeeping point of view, I think the, the value in having Robin Henley goal actually, in goal for Mayo actually showed from the goal that we scored, because... I think he got fed up with just clipping out short kickouts to Mayo and letting them have a slow build up attacks for, for our goal. He actually boomed a long kick over the top of the of the London players that were kind of getting back into position to Jordan Flynn, I think it was, and Jordan had only one thing on his mind: long ball inside to Killian Connor, and the ball's in the back of the set, back of the net, probably less than ten seconds from the ball. The time it leaves Robbie's foot, so that was that was brilliant from him, and just from a. A positive point of view, Killian O'Connor as well. Just to get sixty or seventy minutes under the belt, like we we mentioned during the week, when's the last time Killian has been fit and available in January? You know what I mean. So if he can just get a run of games where he's just playing, I'm not too concerned if he's playing well. To be honest, he showed glimpses today of what he can do. Absolutely, and the goal is one of them. He got on loads of ball. He he probably had a lot of assists. I'd say in that first half as well. Just the fact that he's playing is a huge positive positive for me, and it shows me that his body is in a fairly good place. So hopefully, he continue that on for the rest of the year.